It's time to get into the top four action here at the Capcom Pup. It's going to be crazy hype. Let's go over to Mike Ross to introduce the players. Ladies and gentlemen, on your winner's side, please make some noise for Knuckle Doo! <laughs> American winners final here at the Capcom Cup. Wow. Wow. <laughs> I can't believe it. You know, honestly, you know, Knuckle Doo versus Ricky Ortiz as a winners final is like a fairy tale story come true for the American fans and people all over. This is incredible. Are you guys going to be getting behind your players here representing the United States? <laughs> Say hi to everybody at home because you're on TV right now. We are broadcasting on ESPN. Oh, look at the love. Bring I it love in, bring them. it in. Yeah! Two incredibly strong performers. Knuckle Do is arguably the best player in the world on form right now. Yep. Today. Yep. And that's why he's in winners' final. This it's interesting. incredibly stacked tournament. You know, the thing for me, Logan, is he, he's. I think the MOV match was probably the closest I've seen to him really being put, like, you know in an uncomfortable situation, and even that was a free one in his favor. Yep. It's going to be really interesting to see if Ricky can finally put this kid, like, at least give him a tough match, you know, no matter the result. Because so far, he's been cruising, absolutely cruising. You talk about Ricky Ortiz, though. She's been so impressive in terms of mental strength. That comeback in the, the winner's semifinal, almost letting it slip 2-0 up. Cruising, set point let it come back to 2-2, but manage to close it out. We've got two incredible competitors for you here. Oh, Fighting for a place in grand finals. Oh, let's go. It's Armika against Chun-Li. Here we go in the ring of destiny. Winners Capcom final. Capcom Cup 2016. And Knuckle Doo starts off with a jump in. Crossing over, gets that counter hit down with fist. And a come on, grab straight away to the stun. Stun so quickly, this corner pressure, the damage, it's all... In front, oh, oh come on, grab the forward fist, no and that's good. gonna close it out. She puts you in that situation, you guess right, and you block. You are minus three, you're still in trouble. Great play, what there, a hugely yeah. dominant first round that was from Knuckle Dude. Can oh, no man. one? Oh, wow, he didn't convert off the drop kick there, almost like he didn't expect his goal with a fireball. Hard knockdown, four dashes, gets the meaty, Ricky in the corner. Trying to make something, look at that. Great patience from Ricky, no button, nothing. Dealing with the pressure well, but it's all knuckle do so far in this set. Oh, the fake cross up. Nice use of that EX spinning bird kick there to... Great activation. Hey! Divine. We'll see if Ricky gets the critical art here. She's been landing fierce into critical art all weekend. Oh, look at the kill, Bidden. Stun's racking up as well. Gonna get it without and that's gonna be in the round. Great result there. I mean, I would have spent it. I would have spent it just for the fact that this kid's been on such fire, but great decision there from Ricky. Both going into the final round of this first game with full EX bar stop, access to that critical eye, huge damage, but of course, both probably going to be using it for their EX special moves, Mika specifically. The choice of anti -air. stays in front there, the instant air legs, catches him with a bird kick, sends her flying into the corner half. He's going to get out of this, got to be careful. Such an easy view reversal. reversal there completely switches around momentum. That backdash though. Jump short, pays off again. Into the corner. Fighting her way out though, Ricky Ortiz. Yeah, fighting well from this position. 
Just get out. Wow, no. Oh, so ready that reversal again. I didn't want anything to do with that anti air crash. Oh, wow, wow. Legs? Okay. No respect for the back throw setup. Here's there the activation. V reversal has to respect the throw. Wait, throw. Complete. Oh, oh, wake up, up Super, super. And it works. This is going to do a chunk of damage, but I don't think it's going to be anywhere near enough. Because oh, that. Oh, he just did it. Oh, my gosh. Wow. Damn. She do not care. Just do it. Yo. What a choice. One up. You thought you thought that these guys are on stage playing for 230k. They're gonna be cagey. They're gonna be holding it back. They're not gonna be taking any oh, risks. Oh crap, I didn't even no. think of that. Wow. No. No sign of nerves. Yo, I think I might be the first set this weekend where Knuckle Deuce lost the first game. Maybe, I'm not sure, maybe. What a huge first round though as well. And again, we're seeing that mental fortitude from Ricky Ortiz taking a battering in that first round. Bring it back. What makes you think he's gone with Mika? You know, he just played MOV arguably, well not arguably, I've seen the him best play, I, I don't remember if it was with God. I don't remember if it was at Canada Cup, but I know it was very recently. He picks Mika on Ricky Ortiz. He picks Mika against players, doesn't he? It's a play. He, both Guile and Mika are good against Chun Li. They don't. I don't necessarily think they specifically beat Chun Li, but they're both good arms. They can fight the matchup, yeah. He picks it on a player by player basis. Takes a little moment. I respect that. He's sticking with his decision. He's staying Mika despite that brilliant first game there from Ricky. Here we go. We're back in jump again. It was basically the same opening to the first game. Oh, and now Ricky's missing an instant air legs. Good punish there. Oh, wow. Gets a counter hit, flat, sends to the corner. Keeping the pressure on. This is down forward first. Great reaction there to whip punish it. Doesn't get the full punish though, but showing, oh, showing Knuckle Dude can't just throw out that shoulder roll freely. Has to space it out properly. We're back to the neutral once more. Oh, great oh, jump. Okay, jump in. The dash goes there on deck. Is she coming out? No, we're going to the corner. We got the mix up. Oh, wow. nice break on the first one again. And we keep Ricky taking all the risks. Been so successful with these cal calculated Good block. Oh, what oh. No punish. Cool dude stays in it. Looking that round out of nowhere. Side switch yeah. works. Slight delay. Gets counting here. Just a clap after the tech there. Just sticks out and it connects. Keeping the pressure on. Not afraid of the spinning bird, but it comes oh, again. Ricky Ortiz has been so on point with that bad clutch of medium oh, punch. Wow. Execution errors here from Knuckle Do, something we haven't seen all weekend. And another big jump in. That's the second fireball that's been jumped in on, and we're going to the corner. Spacing it out. Shoulder activation, of course. V reversal. Oh, there it is. No juggle. Oh, that's Come big on, damage, grab. though. Just about survive. Ooh. And then it. Oh, tried to wake up with a crouch medium, but got caught by the jumping drop kick. One round of bees here in the second game. Oh, he's taking it. Second yeah, one game. It was a knuckle dude. Great performance. Very Thumbs quick up, adaptation, yeah. and he was right to stick with Mika in the end, because we saw there, it looked like it might be worth bringing out the guy who did so well against MOV. But he knows I think more than we do. To your guns. Yeah, I mean, he knows why he's picked her. You've come all the way so far, the whole season. And Mika's basically got you here. Come on, grab C. Great C. So Knuckle Dude. Racing on that, that shoulder. Oh, wow. Just got underneath. We needed that. That's a good decision there from Knuckle Dude. Just to slow down some of that Ricky momentum. He really starts putting on there in the corner. Oh, the drop kick connects. Just caught a jab. That's really costly. Meaty forward medium, great play there. And that all came from that drop kick. Tried to interrupt with crouch, light punch, light punch. Look like at that light punch was just out. I'm not even sure he did that on reaction. So unfortunate. But great play from Knuckle Dude to make it count. Gets the count here. Sends her flying. Keeping the pressure on. Trying to bait out that split. Oh, just press buttons in between. It's not going to pay off. Well, Knuckle Dude respecting the wake up. Yeah, he wanted the bird kick there, didn't he? Twice now. Oh man, that splash just keeps connecting. Another count hit medium into the clap. Ricky not been allowed oh. to play on all this set. Knuckle Dude takes it. That was really smart enough to do there. He tried to bait the spinning bird kick twice already. It didn't Weird. come. Man, what changed? He made there? a read there that it was going to come again and it did. He closed it out.
that game was more like the games we've seen from the guy all weekend. But, but considering how difficult the first two matches were, what changed? He's getting big jump hits. Got a big drop kick. I think he's just making the, making the reads on these jumps and these drop kicks, and they're working out for him. And he knows what happens when Mika makes reads and it work out, works out for him. Yeah. He died. Corner pressure again, and the stun's racking up. Oh man! Stay there. You're not jumping Ricky, out. No oh, way. and a throw bait. Oh, oh and wow. that's going to be set point now for Knuckle Do. Knuckle Do, absolutely in her head right now. Every decision spot on. Oh man, that fake cross up just keeps hitting. Ricky Ortiz cannot deal with these jump ins. He's mixing up with the splashes as well. On the needs to be more active. I think the defensive, the defensive decisions aren't working. So maybe start yeah. putting on the offense. Missed the bird kick. Got away with it. Go, Ricky! Cool. Needs now. to make it. Really needs to make it. Really, absolutely needs to make this count. Set point down, but bringing it up. Square Lovely off. Five, nice conversion. Double. Making it two-two would be all the difference. But Mika's got all the resources she needs. Nice anti at that time. Delays again. Oh, can't let her get started here. But be careful. The desk go. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Knuckle Dude has seen the pattern of punish. Amazing decision. Oh, good block, though. Oh, critical oh, block. Didn't go into it. Oh, anyway. and after that, Ricky Ortiz after that. Huge oh, wow. critical art from Knuckle Dude's Mika. That's going to do a world of good go, to Ricky Saki bringing it back after that. Yeah, Knuckle Dude unable to close out the round after that fantastic decision. So ready. Goes for the meaty again. That time badly spaced, but wasn't able to get the full combo. He's in the corner again. The footsies tool. Seems to have spent an eternity in this corner versus Knuckle doing this set. Wow, the jump just beats the stand like it clean. Gets over. Connects. You, you forget about that corner. jump fierce that Mika's got, but the hitbox on it is tremendous. Oh, that could have been the end, Logan. Nice anti at that time. Trying to bait something out. Oh, Here we Keep go. Yeah. Went for the reset, didn't get it. Overhead misses. Still has some V-trigger left, but here comes the Desco. Oh, oh, is that going to be it? Oh, it's extension. And another 3-1 for Knuckle Doo. And Knuckle Doo, the favorite, marches on to grand finals. Man, He's going to play for that prestigious Capcom Cup and a not too sizable check as well. Well, he's guaranteed a top two finish now. He's really in the money, but wow, not just that. Showing how important it is to be in form at the right time. So many players that started off the season looking so dominant. Your infiltrations, your taquitos, both going 0 and 2 in this top 32 bracket. Meanwhile, Knuckle Dude is sitting there in grand finals. He's come into form when it mattered. Let's look at the action here one oh, yeah, more time so we can absolutely. see exactly how he break it back, uh, brought it that back. He started off so powerfully as well. We didn't see the first round, but it was almost the perfect. Uh, Ricky Ortiz brought it back and won two rounds straight. To I won the first one game, nil, yeah. yeah. Big deal to win that first game. But, you know, Nakudu was analyzing a lot, man. Picking up on a lot I of stuff. Some of, the, some of the punishes were just... Nakudu, Nakudu's got a really good stubborn style as well. Like, wow, when he water sees that you Ricky. can't deal with something, he's going to stick with that yeah. over and over and over again. And the jump-ins were really paying off. He was jumping in with splash, he's jumping in with light kick, he's jumping Picking in with fierce at one point. Yeah, they like beat. I mean, that angle was horrible. Stan like it just got absolutely beat out. What a decision there to press a button from Ricky. Huge, didn't pay huge, off. huge pressure in the corner. That, and that was, was just because he'd be reversal every single Nadesco activation up to that point. We're so used to seeing um, that the Miko react with the EX command grab, right? Massive damage there. Great reactions to be ready for the critical arc. That's, and he closed yeah. it out. He advances into grand finals. But let's take a look uh, at how the rest of the bracket is forming up.